Have you ever wondered what happened to the Venera missions to Venus? Why did these groundbreaking probes suddenly fall silent in the midst of their exploration? Today, we unravel the mystery behind why Venera went silent on Venus using newly released images that provide startling clues. Imagine sending a spacecraft into the harshest environment known to humanity. Venus, where surface temperatures can melt lead and pressures crush submarines. What did these images reveal about the fate of these brave missions? How did scientists piece together the puzzle of what went wrong? The Venera missions, launched by the Soviet Union, were pioneering endeavors to explore Venus up close, aiming to capture unprecedented images and data. Yet after numerous successful landings, communication abruptly ceased, leaving scientists perplexed for decades. Now with the aid of advanced technology and meticulous analysis, we are closer than ever to understanding the untold story of Venera's silent mission. Join us as we delve into the intriguing journey of Venera and uncover the secrets hidden within Venus's hostile atmosphere. The Venera missions stand as a testament to human ingenuity and determination in the face of extreme challenges. Launched by the Soviet Union between 1961 and 1984, these missions were designed to penetrate the thick veil of mystery surrounding Venus, our neighboring planet often referred to as Earth's evil twin. The primary objectives were ambitious, to study Venus's atmosphere, surface conditions, and geological features up close. Imagine the technological feats required to achieve this. The Venera spacecraft had to withstand temperatures exceeding 450 degrees Celsius and atmospheric pressures equivalent to being nearly a kilometer underwater. These conditions are more extreme than those found on Mars or even within the depths of our oceans. Yet against all odds, several Venera missions succeeded in delivering invaluable data and images back to Earth. However, the fate of these missions wasn't without its challenges and mysteries. As Venera probes landed on Venus's surface, they transmitted images and scientific data, revealing a landscape dominated by volcanic plains and rocky outcrops. Each successful transmission added to our understanding of Venus's hostile environment. Yet, the triumphs of the Venera missions were tempered by moments of sudden and unexplained silence. In the midst of their groundbreaking exploration, these spacecraft would inexplicably stop communicating with Earth. The exact reasons for these communication failures remained elusive for years, shrouded in the harsh realities of space exploration. One of the most infamous cases was Venera 13. Launched on October 30th, 1981, Venera 13 successfully landed on Venus on March 1, 1982, sending back the first color images of Venus's surface. These images were not only awe-inspiring, but also scientifically significant, offering unprecedented glimpses of the planet's geology. However, after just 127 minutes on the surface, Venera 13 fell silent. Scientists were left puzzled. What had caused the mission to abruptly cease transmission? Decades later, in recent years, new hope for answers emerged with the release of previously unreleased images from the Venera missions. These images, meticulously analyzed by scientists around the globe, provided fresh insights into the conditions faced by the Venera probes on Venus's surface. They also reignited interest in understanding what might have led to the sudden loss of communication during these missions. One of the key challenges faced by the Venera probes was the intense heat and pressure on Venus. The planet's atmosphere is mainly composed of carbon dioxide with clouds of sulfuric acid, creating a corrosive environment that tested the durability of the spacecraft. The electronics and communication systems designed to withstand these extreme conditions sometimes succumbed unexpectedly. 
Furthermore, Venus's surface conditions presented additional hurdles. The high temperatures and pressures caused rapid degradation of materials, affecting the longevity of the spacecraft and their ability to function properly over extended periods. Despite these challenges, the Venera missions achieved remarkable successes, pushing the boundaries of our knowledge about Venus and paving the way for future planetary exploration. The newly released images from the Venera missions have provided scientists with critical clues about the fate of these pioneering spacecraft on Venus. One of the most intriguing aspects revealed by these images is the physical deterioration of the probes over time. Despite being designed to withstand Venus's extreme conditions, the harsh environment took its toll on the Venera spacecraft. Analysis of the images shows signs of corrosion and damage to the exterior surfaces of the probes. This corrosion likely compromised vital components, including antennas and communication equipment, leading to intermittent or complete loss of contact with Earth. The corrosive atmosphere of Venus, filled with sulfuric acid clouds and temperatures hot enough to melt lead, posed challenges that engineers had never faced before. The Venera probes faced extreme conditions on Venus, with temperatures surpassing 450 degrees Celsius and atmospheric pressures 92 times that of Earth's sea level. These harsh environments accelerated material degradation and posed mechanical challenges, such as structural failures and ceiling breaches. Combined with their limited design lifespan, these factors contributed to the loss of communication during multiple Venera missions. Despite these challenges, the probes achieved historic milestones, including the first successful landings on another planet and groundbreaking data collection. Each image and discovery from these missions continues to provide invaluable insights into Venus's hostile conditions and planetary exploration challenges. As we continue to analyze the data and images from the Venera missions, scientists remain optimistic about uncovering more secrets hidden within Venus's tumultuous atmosphere. The legacy of the Venera missions lives on, inspiring future generations of space explorers to push the boundaries of what is possible in the exploration of our solar system. What do you think was the most challenging aspect of exploring Venus with the Venera missions? Leave your thoughts in the comments below and don't forget to like, subscribe to the Space Centric Archive community and hit the notification bell for more fascinating insights into space exploration. Thank you for joining us on this journey through the cosmos.